No? I'm always I, I never sit alone but I, I I'm not waiting for anyone why did you finish already yeah oh, okay so, I always come to eat in the canteen to make new friends and that that's why I, that's my that's the main reason and uh, most of the time I sit with a student who doesn't speak English and that's that's bad <laughs> you was my teacher hmm? you was my teacher hmm. um, a year ago how many years ago two years ago yeah I'm, I'm here for three years already <clears throat> Do, do you still have English classes or not? We don't have English classes. Don't have any English classes anymore, okay. Mm. Is this your camera? Hmm? Is this your camera? Yes. Here? Yeah. I'm always recording, but I, I don't uh, keep, m most of the time I delete, but if something good happens, then I, then I keep it. I want to do that too. Hmm? I, I want to have a camera too, uh, mm. but I don't have enough money to buy it. Oh, this one is very cheap. How much is it? I, I don't know, maybe a hundred, hundred fifty you want something like that. Yeah. It does record around three hours. It's a good, um, it's a good amount of time, three, three, three to four hours. Yeah. Sometimes I record them in my classes too. When I was teaching you, I didn't have this camera. This is a new camera. No, I wasn't recording my classes back then. You still post some videos on... Um, you could... Yeah? You yeah, could. I have... Do you, know, um, do you know my website? I don't know your website. S send me a message. You, have my, you still have my WeChat, right? Uh, yeah. Send me a message. Oh, wait. Mm. And then I reply to you with my website. <clears throat> mm -hmm. 
The two of you, right? Mm. Okay. So if you mm. click, this is the link. All oh, right, I took a picture with you, right? <laughs> <laughs> This is my this is my website. That, that's my blog, but also there's a other. If you go to the menu there, there's some free courses. I I, I don't remember if I did have the website when I was teaching you. I did you remember? I don't remember. I probably didn't have it. Yeah, this, this website is kind of a new, maybe one or two years. But um, every now and then I was writing a blog post, so you can follow in the in the blog section. That, that's the link. <clears throat> so, do you keep uh, practicing? Practicing. practicing? Do you, do you keep practicing English? Yeah. Keep yeah. studying? Yes. Mm. We always practice. Mm. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you should practice with each other. <laughs> Just our English is not good. <clears throat> So how, how when when are you going to graduate? Mm. So I was your teacher in the first year, second year? First year. First year. Yeah. Two years ago. This is your third year? Yeah. Third? You have one more year? Yeah. <clears throat> so what are you going to do? After graduation, mm. it's hard to say. Mm. Maybe a lawyer. Maybe what? Lawyer. But are you going to when I look for a job? A lot, lot of my students that I ask this question, they tell me that they're, they're going to keep studying. They're going to try to do the master degree. Or are you going to finish and try to look for a job? I think I will mm. get in. Master degree, mm. and, and look for a job. Mm -mm. Everybody tell me that they're gonna keep studying. Why is that? Because they are, they are afraid to find a job. Yeah, the, I, 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 I have heard that right now it's very hard to find a job. Yeah. The, the, right? Yeah. So, so they are afraid. Mm. They are afraid to face a society. <clears throat> Keep studying is not a bad thing, right? So you increase your degree, maybe it's going to be easier to find a better job. But, uh, <clears throat> yeah. <coughs> what about you? Yes, I have lots of them. 
for example, op open that, uh, open that my blog there. For example, if you're if you're thinking about uh, looking for a job, I have uh, one post that about networking. Networking is the best way to look for a job. <coughs> Let me see here. For example, this post here is for helping students to find for a job. So this is one of the first posts. So let's see here, maybe page, I don't know, seven, let's see. Maybe eight. This one here, networking is an essential part of building a successful career. For example, if you're looking for an easy way, the, the best way to look for a job is to, but for example, you need to build your network first. For example, if I were a student like you, I probably would be making more friends. For example, friends with the people from other courses, maybe go to the other canteen in the other side of the campus. You know, there's another campus, right? Maybe go there, sit like me, for example, I'm sitting here today, you're my student, but if I wasn't eating with you, probably I would be eating with other students. Mm -hmm. And then, no, oh, do you speak English? No, okay, can I have your WeChat? So just make friends with students, right? Yeah. So the more friends you make it, the easy is gonna be for you to find a job. Because for example, one day, every one of you is gonna graduate, right? So maybe he's gonna find a job first. And then the, the company, oh, we're still hiring people. Do you have anyone to, to indicate? So, may oh, no, I have a friend, and then they maybe indicate you or maybe send a message, oh, my company is still hiring, Do, are you interested in, in coming here? So, I found my job here in China like this because of a friend. A friend told me, oh, do you want to come here and teach in China? And then I said yes, I sent my resume to, to, to her and she gave it to the human resources. Otherwise, you're gonna be sending like everyone else. You, you send it to the company. Company receives thousands of, of resumes. But if you send to a friend, and a friend gives to the human resources, she's putting you in front of everybody. So that, that post tells the, my story, how did I find a job in China, and how can you use the same met methodology, right? This is the easiest way to find a, to, to find a job. For example, I, I wrote about many other things. For example, the importance of keep studying English. A lot of my students, they, they, they study English to get grades, and that if they don't have English classes anymore, they stop studying. But English is gonna be the one skill that's gonna help you to find a better job, than, than even more than your graduation qualificate, even more than the, your uh, university graduation certificate. And uh, it, it doesn't matter, it, it doesn't matter if you have good or bad grades. If they wanna hire somebody who can speak English, they probably are going to interview you in English. If you cannot hold a conversation in English, they will not hire you. But if you do speak English, you're gonna find a better job than anyone else because just a few people speak English. So my advice, for example, if you're, I don't, probably I said, I said this, right, in the, when you're my student. If you're my student, start studying English just a little bit every day because in four years you can have your English maybe a low level, you can start low level, but in four years you can have a high level. And this is gonna help you a lot, find a good job. Make more money and things like that. So do, do you want advice for other things? Any other thing? <laughs> For example, are you dating each other? Or, yeah, that's what I'm asking. So, for example, I, I usually ask students, uh, do you guys have a boyfriend or girlfriend? You, most students don't have it, right? Yeah. So, university years is also very good to find a girlfriend and boyfriend. To, to, for example, look, at, look around you. Everybody is the, at the same age as you, about around 10, 20 years of age. Everyone have a university degree. So where are you going to have the same opportunity again? So a lot of, I, I remember once uh, I, I eating with the boys on the second floor, they're all roommates, five boys. I, send, I sit there, make friends with them. And then one of them tell them, teacher, 
I never had a girlfriend. Can you help me <laughs> get a girlfriend? <laughs> I said, really? And then I said, yes, I can help you, but not the way you think. So I, I asked him, well, let's go downstairs. The first floor has more people, right? And then you're going to find a cute girl and then we're going to sit together. And then he was too shy. I said, no, no, no. I said, don't worry. Just come with me. And then I, and then we come, come here, right? The, set, the first floor and then start looking. And then he saw, oh, there's a cute girl there in the corner. Okay, let's go there. And she came behind me. She was too shy. I came there, sit uh, close to the girl. I said, oh, can I sit here? And they said, yes. I, and then she, they, 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 they didn't speak English very well. So I was started asking him, yeah, can you translate for me? And then in the end, I just sit there and he's talking to the girl. I, I keep silent because uh, they didn't speak English well. So he starts speaking in Chinese with them. And then after 30 minutes, we finish the meal. They, they leave the table. And then I ask him, how hard was that? And he said, well, it was not that hard. I, that me that was a sh very shy. And then I said, well, if you start doing this every day, you're going to make friends with girls. And pretty soon you're going to have a girlfriend. But for example, this is a good for making friends. This is good for increasing network. And this is good for many. This is a, how you're going to foster more opportunities in your life. And most of the students, they're not doing this. For example, when was the last time you make a new friend? Many, many days ago. Yes, I make a new friend every day. So. It, this is a good thing, make, new, make good friends, because you can help each other. <clears throat> for example, I, I advise you to read my article about the, the for example, if you, I, I even record the class. Maybe I teach you this class. I don't know if I teach you this class three years ago. But uh, the first semester, all, all the first uh, class of the semester, I teach this class. And I record it here. Uh, you can have a Yuku here. This is a recorded. Where is it? Okay, not here. Yes, here. For example, I have recorded. You can click here and watch the class in Yuku. <coughs> this is me teaching how to build up your network. Mm. <coughs> How long have you been dating each other? Oh, ten months. Yeah. Huh? Ten months. Ten months. Every time a student asks me, not every time, when I have a question that is being asked many times, I wrote, I wrote something and, put, and make a post. For example, most of the time my posts there are answering to what the students are asking me. For example, if a student, for example, a lot of students are asking me, are you here alone, do you miss your family? So I wrote about uh, loneliness. Right? Mm -hmm. So, yes, I have a post there about loneliness. I talk about it's a good experience to go abroad, so I love my job here, I make friends. Mm -hmm. But of course, I miss my family events, right? This is the price that you have to pay if you go abroad one day, right? Because, you can, because you're going to be very far away from home. You cannot go for birthdays every weekend, right? So I go back home once in a year. Can you do it? <clears throat> 
come back home on winter vacation? So this year I went back home. So I was home in August, July and August. So, but I came here to teach another year. But I was here on the pandemic time. I was here four years without going back to Brazil because nobody could travel, right? This semester, something happens. Something that I, I, I didn't, I don't remember it happened when I was teaching your class. But this last semester, I got a lot of students cheating in the exam. <laughs> so, so next semester, they still going to be my student. So my first day, I would be teaching a class about ethics. So how important is to be honest? Right? For example, would you hire an employee that you cannot trust? For example, when you're, when you're cheating on an exam, it's not really too bad because you're not hurting someone, right? But this is a wrong thing to do because you're going the wrong direction. So I'm preparing a special class to talk about this because they're still going to be my students, right? So if they don't correct what the direction they're going, they're, they're going to... They will, for example, right now do something bad, a small thing, but then they're gonna be a bigger one, bigger, and then and then one day they're gonna end up in jail. Yeah. All right. So, for example, here there's not too much of a consequence because cheating. Maybe the, the teacher is gonna be mad at you. Maybe take a few points from your test, but nothing more than that, really, right? Maybe if the extreme case, maybe a teacher would fail the student. But I didn't fail them. I kind of punish a little bit, just, uh, okay, you're going to pass, but with the minimum grades instead of uh, high grades. But then I'm going to be talking why a person should be doing the right things, right? Because if you keep doing the wrong things, like cheating or doing something, someday somebody will get you. For example, if I get you in the school, it's not too bad. But if an employer gets you doing something wrong and trying to hide, they're going to fire you. For example, if you're married, you need your salary, you have to pay mortgage or whatever, you have some uh, things that you have to you start your life, right? You have to pay things. So if you lose a job, this is going to be very hard. Right now, the student doesn't have a job, so it's not too hard, right? The, just wait, uh, losing a few points. So, yeah, I, you can see I have lots of posts when I, when I start doing this. I kind of... Uh, Every week or so, I write one post because of things that are happening. But uh, yes, when I got here, I didn't have the website. So you're the first class that I, the first year that I was here. So. <clears throat> All right, I finished. I'm gonna go. Very nice that uh, we can eat together and can see how you're doing. Huh? Yes, that's that's second picture. And you can put it on. Your HR, your background. Yes, yes, I will do the same. I do the same. Yes, I, for example, I did it with. I did it with most of people, right? So let me. Okay, let's. Let me find you here. So you're this one. This, West. this one, Wes. Okay. <coughs> no, she's gonna take it too. Okay, take it. No, let let me take one more too. One too. Okay. <clears throat> and we gotta go. Okay. Nice to see you again. Okay. See you again. Bye bye. <clears throat> Good. Bye bye. Bye bye.